thanks to Gali Trophies, a bit of an upset today, and what a what a propelling uh, thing to happen going into uh, Silly Sunday. I'm joined by Zach DeClover. Crew Point have just beaten Ty Ab away to end their season. Um, we'll, we'll not think about Silly Sunday yet, but you've got uh, a win going into next year, mate. Yeah, it's massive for us, uh, especially after the last few weeks. Uh, we've been belted, I think, by 120 and 160, and um, it really hurt us last week. There was a lot of boys in tears after the game, and um, yeah, we, we just promised ourselves this week that's not going to happen, and we come out and we knew we knew we were in for a big crack today after what's happened, and it was great to get the win. We brought some under 19s back. We've been kind of putting them on ice for finals, so we brought some of our good kids back. We had two new game, uh, first gamers. Uh, yeah, and we were just really hurt. We were really hurt. We thought we've got one more effort to give, and we gave it everything, and it was it, it paid off. Yeah. How pleasing was it knowing that there's something to build on yeah. more than the vibe that was coming out to end this season? Yeah, 100. percent And we got off the bottom as well. Um, who were the better players today, mate? It was pretty even spread. Uh, Jacob Cook has been our best player by a mile. He's kicked a few goals from the outside 50 against the wind. I think other than that, it was pretty even spread. My brother kicked the winning goal, so. He, he was oh right. no, he's going to be uh, a bit of a weapon later tonight, I reckon, and tomorrow. But um, look, congratulations on a, a hard-fought win last round, mate. Enjoy the uh, end of season festivities. I'm here with the Crew Point coach Steve Hamill, mate. What a win today! Yeah, no, fantastic way to finish the year. Um, Tyab, we always thought that they were um, going to have a bit of a crack against us, and um, for us to set up well, was, we were really happy with that. Our last two weeks have been disappointing, yeah. Um, which so it's nice to sort of finish off there. And we brought a few kids back today, yeah. And everyone had a bit of a crack, so it was terrific. Dr. Kluver just said to me previously that you know there was a few people in tears. There was some real low points, yeah. um, but what a high point today! Yeah, look, and um, when you're a side that's won one game up to the down, it's about keeping morale and belief. Um, we've got a really good um, gr group of young men playing under 23s, uh, including under 19. So. We know there's a future of the club and it's just a maintaining that. Um, playing three boys today, their finals for next week is the third, so yeah, things are positive. A nice way to finish and a bit of a reward for our, our senior players today. How far away do you think the club is and, the, and this group is away from turning that into some Ws? Look, I think um, in regards to the list we've got now, they're probably a year or two away from developing as a group, so they're going to be stronger in a year or two. We do need to recruit a couple of players, we need a forward. Yeah, we need probably a really good midfielder that's got a bit of um, uh, ability to bring Blaze in. But yeah, yeah, we've had really good glimpses over the last eight, eight or nine weeks. As in the last two weeks were disappointing. Um, but again, today it was really nice they bounced back. Well, I reckon you've done a terrific job with this group, mate. I look forward to see what you can do in years to come. Yeah, appreciate it. Enjoy the night. Um, congratulations on your second win for the year. Thank you. Get your game face on.